Forest. Who lives in the forest? Forest homes. I wonder where the forest animals live. On a hike in the forest, Misu spots a home in a tree. It must belong to a bee. It, mu it must belong to a robin. It must belong to a squirrel. Look, someone made a home in a log. I bet it belongs to a coyote. I bet it belongs to a skunk. I bet it belongs to a bobcat. I bet it belongs... Do you think an animal lives in this pond? It's a nice home for a frog. It's a nice home for a beaver. It's a nice home for a turtle. Could an animal live in this cave? A cave is a great home for a bat. A cave is a great home for a bat. A cave is a great home for a bear. A cave is a great home for a fox. Miso finds a home in the ground. This burrow belongs to a marmot. This burrow belongs to a chipmunk. This burrow belongs to a prairie dog. This burrow belongs to a rabbit. Wow, animals live everywhere in the forest. The end. Oh. 
Red foxes have five toes on their front paws, but only four on their back paws. The forest is home to many plants and animals. Let's keep it clean for them. Robin are off to visit Larry's cousin, Barry. It's so nice to be in the forest. Larry sees a raccoon. He is curious. Larry sees a raccoon. He is shy. Larry sees a raccoon. He is excited. Wow, that's a big waterfall. Wow. Wow, that's a big cave. Wow, that's a big moose. Phew, it's hot. Let's take a water break. Crossing the stream, Robin feels brave. Cro crossing the stream, Robin feels silly. Crossing the stream, Robin feels scared. Crossing the stream, Robin feels brave. Look, there's a spider. Look, there's a porta potty. Look, there's a bear. Look, there's Look. Almost there. Yay, we made it to Barry's cabin. Time for a forest tea party. The end. <laughs>